um, it's a big store. It is a big store. So There's so much cool stuff. There is a lot of cool stuff. Okay. Um, Where to start? Oh, that's cool. Well, uh, let's start with kids because oh, we don't yeah. sell as much of the holidays. kids' stuff. So, and it's, you know, we don't sell as much of the kids' stuff. Put this back inside real quick. I'll have to get cardboard. Now I got this one reorganized. Now I got to reorganize room two. It's just a little bit tougher. Okay. Um, all right. So, kids' stuff. I don't have to put the catopoly on there because it's doing fine. Well, actually, yes. I mean, if we could sell 100 catopolies, let's do it. Well, we already <laughs> almost have. I've got to put it back in the system, which means i got to go turn my computer back on. I can do that in a minute. Um, but yeah, it's doing just fine. I'd rather put stuff on that isn't doing as well. Um, so, all right. So I'm being a white. Yeah, okay, sure. We'll go with that. All right. So, um, are you are you doing live or are you doing what are you doing? I'm gonna edit it. Okay. Good. Thank you. Okay. So, um, here we are in our kids section, which we're eventually gonna call the Cubs maybe not this corner. Well, I have to. <laughs> yeah. Let's start that over itch. again. I had an itch. Um, here we are in our kids section, which we're gonna call the Cubs corner. Um, That's uh, so cute. All right. Well, let me try. Um, and uh, we have lots of kids shirts. So the girls' stuff is over here on the right. All the shirts are thirteen dollars. We've got the cute little geek cheek because geek is in because you know, Big Bang Theory and stuff. And they're geeky girls. Trust me, I am one. Um, and then for those who like bling, we have this. And you say these are all thirteen? Mm -hmm. Yep, they're all thirteen. And do they all say Big Cat Rescue? Yes, they do. Um, somewhere on them. Uh, yes. Uh, we have the cool little girls who like the different sunglasses. Maybe the little fashionistas a little more. And then um, we got the babies. I can't forget the babies. And it's so freaking cute. Yep, um, we have all kinds of cool things for travel. Uh, don't forget the kids. Um, the neck pillows, they'll actually work for adults too. We try them on all the time and they're like, yeah, this will work. So um, it's for cross country. Oh, the um, they call them critter pillars. They are $10. The little cross country travel game is $3 and it has all the different states. You can play it multiple times. And then, since we live in Florida and we have lots of snowbirds, it also has Canada um, provinces. So you can do that. Plus, they can learn the provinces of another country. So, so that's they check cool. it off when they mm -hmm. see they it? They check it off when they see it on the road. Yeah. That's clever. Um, yeah, that's pretty cool. We used to play games like that. So, so all of our. Punching each other. Well, we did that too. Punch <laughs> buggy. You can't forget that. That's You got to always do that. So, um, we have lots of different stuffies. You pick the best stuffed animal. Oh, he is so cute. Um, he's called the Tubby Wubby. We don't have any lines that look like this. Um, but we celebrate Christmas by putting little ribbons on them. We also celebrate Hanukkah. We don't forget you guys. Got the little Hanukkah ribbons too. Some of them actually have Hanukkah stuff on them. Uh, the bigger guys are 15, I believe. Yes, 15. And then the smaller guys are 7. We have all kinds of cutie pie, small ones. These don't have ribbons because they must have just got put out. We have male and female lion. They're both $7. And tell me about the way those feel. Oh, they're nice and soft and cuddly. They do have beanies in them. Um, so they're kind of weighted down a little bit. Um, it might not be for teeny, teeny, tiny kids because teeny little hands can pull things off. I don't know how, but they have the ability. And so um, maybe five or older for these guys. Um, and then... We have the little lynx with the little snow leopard. It's one of the cutest things ever. It's so cute. Even though we don't have snow leopards, we used to, so we still have these guys. Um, oh, and this is like the greatest find ever. If you the serval, you can't find serval stuffed serval. So when I found them, I just keep getting them. Um, but this is a little stuffed serval. It's not exactly right because technically he should have some little stripes and. No. but mm, we'll take what we can get right um <laughs> we tried to get an ocelot made and they were like yeah you have to make like uh five thousand pieces and i was like i don't want to have them for 10 years so that's <laughs> not gonna work so we did not get an ocelot made um and how much is that uh this one's 15 as well and then we have a cute little tiger because we got lots of those and all dressed up for christmas Aww. um and this one's also seven because it's a little uh stuffy um, and there was a lynx in the basket there. There's, yeah, there's the lynx. Technically, they're both lynxes. <laughs> you know how I know? 
Look at the sales. <laughs> They're both lynxes. This one is called a bobcat. This one is called a lynx. They're technically both lynxes. So, but anyway, they're both they're both um, fifteen dollars. They do come. A couple of these come with little informations, little informationals about the species. Oh, sorry, about the species. Oh, that's nice. It sure looks like our cat. Yeah, so it's cool. I know. <laughs> but what's funny um, is that even looks more like a bob. That even looks a little more like a lynx face than a bobcat face. But that's okay. Well, I thought Siberian lynx. That. That's what I was thinking. But it says bobcat. <laughs> so it does the same thing on. We used to have a cougar one, and it said lion on it. I was like, it's a cougar. I was like, but that's what I was like, we're the cat people. They are not. They're trying, but, you know. So we have some boy shirts here, too, or Tom Girls, whatever. I would have worn these, too. Um, cute little time, uh, a little miles per hour, because here you know, start with turtles, which is what we can all run faster than all the way up to cheetahs. Oh, so, so that's very, very cool. Okay. Mm -hmm. I did not get it. Yeah, it's very cool. <laughs> And that's $13. Yep, and those all the kids' shirts for $13. Uh, this one is for your skaters. A little board to be wild. Oh, They've got the paw print on the skateboard. He's looking really cool, dude. So it's got our little Tampa, Florida in there, too, if you forget where we are. Um, but all of these, you can be little walking billboards for us, which would be awesome. And then we've got some DC stuff going on with uh, Superman <laughs> and some Marvel stuff going on with Iron Man. So we can't leave out either, you know, uh, comic book universe because oh we're all nerdy people here. A um, couple other little travel games that are really kind of cool. If you're traveling for the holidays, which you most likely are, it's Thanksgiving. Uh, we've got these flash cards. They've got beautiful pictures of animals on them, but you'll also learn stuff while you're playing. So that's pretty cool. These are $5. Uh, and then this little travel game is a memory game. Uh, we have a bigger version as well, but this is the travel version. And it's all the little animals. The squares are about this big, and you flip and flip till you match. I was great at memory. This is also $5. Um, my two games that I was great at were Memory and Connect 4. I have no idea why. Those were just mine. Um, another little learning dealio that's great are um, these little animal packs. We've got, you know, from all over the world, aquatic, African, aviary got our tigers and stuff with the asian um america i think they get the uh cougars and the oh it's actually got a black leopard on it it's not really an american thing but we'll take it um maybe south american black jaguar maybe they're going with america Amer oh it does say the americas i can read anyway um so yeah buy one for honey <laughs> yeah, apparently i need to go to the center for kids who can't read good anybody who's a zoolander fan will get that um more christmas I'm just for Christmas. I'm a little black leopard. Um, yeah, these sell really well, too. Um, they're super cute. He's got green eyes. Um, this is the weird little zombie kitty that Carol loves, and I creeps me out big time. Does so. he still purr? He does, but I don't turn him on because he creeps me out. I hear, oh, that's the whole purpose I hear, of him being there. And I'm like, what is happening? <laughs> no, I had one little girl pick it up. She was, like, petting it, and I'm like, please, no, stop. So for those of you who like to read, we have adult books up top. Um, well, not like adult books. <laughs> well, not like triple X adult books, but books for adults to read. And kids can read them too. Um, they're going to be informational about the pet trade and what we're trying to end. Uh, they're probably going to make you a little angry, which is fine because you probably don't even know this is going on. Uh, but this is why we do what we do to try to end these kinds of things. So if you read Blood of the Tiger, we are featured in that. I believe we're in Chapter 11. And the Pill Game features us as well. Um, he's a local writer and uh, the bad guys receive some punishment that would not ever technically happen. It's fiction. Let's just put it that way. And Losing Paradise is actually the book that I read back in the 90s, I think, that is caused that me what, to become a vegetarian. Is it what kind of got you started? That's yeah. kind of cool. So we have all these other uh, educational books. We've got the Everything Big Cats. These are Nat Geo. They're great books. Um, also, if you have a, a colorer, or a colorer, a kid who likes to color, I don't know how to say that. Um, An artist. These are amazing books. Uh, the books are not that expensive. They are, let's see, these are $6. They have some pretty incredible, of course, if you, you know, color them up they'll look like that um but they're really beautiful i would like to get you know what i would like to get i'd like to get cindy arthur to make one oh, i would love yeah. to have her make one because she'd be great so you can you know they're very detailed we could probably have her do like a scaled down version and then a detailed version i think she would love that so she'd be great Woo! they're falling over that's not good stay um, then we've got the sticker encyclopedia. I believe this one is 15, 
$15.50. Um, all kinds of stickers. I was hugely into stickers when I was a kid, and if they were animal stickers, it was even better. So we've got some more animal sticker books down here. Animal animals, and then cats. I always look and see if I know the cat that's on the cover. I don't, <laughs> but they've used this cat for everything. It's the same tiger on a bunch of their stuff. And ask me how I know it's the same one, because I can tell them apart. Because <laughs> their faces look different. So we've got bookmarks. These are actually really cool. They're magnetic bookmarks, and they feature our cats. So they're $2. So what you do is, whatever page you're on, you put this around the page, and then it sits oh. on the page like this. If you can get that, it's really teeny tiny. Oh, but then you, don't lose your, then you don't lose your place. So we've got all kinds. Uh, the Cubs are on there. Nabisco. I've never seen that yeah, they're really cool. Nabisco's on there. Um, we've got uh, Zuccari, Joseph, um, Nirvana, Jumanji, or no, Saber, um, Zabu, and then the Cougar Cubs are all together on there as well. What a so, great campus. Yeah, it's kind of neat. Uh, small, you know, stocking stuffers. We've got some really cool stocking stuffers. Um, very, very cool stuff. And then the coloring book uh, that has um, a little more about what happens with cubs and things in the wild. Or not in the wild, in the pet trade. So it also kind of, a, you know, lets kids know that um, that's not really the best thing for cubs. Over here we have tons of 3D, cool, really cool 3D stuff. I won't spin it too fast or you'll all get sick. Um, so when I was putting it out here, that was a lot of fun. We've got some notebooks. They're $5. They're blank inside, but they've got really cool images on them. These are what they call their posters. They're $10. Um, you can put them on your wall. They kind of follow you around the room. Yeah, you um, can't really tell with the camera here that it's like three. It looks really weird on the camera. It does look weird on the camera. <laughs> but it's just noticed very that. cool. But they are very cool. And if you spin it too fast while you're loading it, you will get sick. Because yeah, I was the first time I was putting them on, I was like, "Whoa, we gotta stop doing that." So they are very cool. We got some that go vertical as well. Some that are a little more um, real life. So these are real pictures, so which oh is actually kind of gosh. cool. Look yeah, at that. the that little links. So the little bobcat kittens, really cool. Wow. Um, we've got postcards. They're three dollars. The bookmarks are also three dollars. Um, kind of neat things. Uh, the postcards I wouldn't necessarily send as a postcard. I would keep it and you know like. <laughs> frame it or something that's kind of cool um and then these guys again do, 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 do. oh we've got some magnets as well um got the really cool saber tooth uh, uh saber tooth tiger i just forgot what it was called holy crap and um they are three i believe yep they're three dollars so not too expensive really kind of cool neat little different gifts uh stocking stuffers here's another one of the real pictures of a puma um in the wild so that's that's kind of cool uh, they all look really neat and different. If you kind of just move them around a little bit, you kind of get the idea. It doesn't quite come across on the camera, but we'll... Yeah, I'm so sad that I can't see it. I know. I think this is my favorite display. Anywhere. These are really cool. These. these are very, very cool. So we'll head on over to... They just um, leap off. The... Oh, look at all they these do. guys I know. together. But yeah, so that's the other... That's the new Big Cat one. And it includes... Um, I think it included cheetahs this time and jaguars. Because the old one... Yeah, the old one didn't have that. The old one had leopards, cougars, lions, tigers, and snow leopards. So, I mean, it was still pretty good. So, uh, over here we have one of the best sellers ever. There's our lovely calendar. They're $15. We do one every year. And this year, for the first time, we feature a lion on the front. It's Miss um, Nikita, Her Royal Highness, as we call her around here. She is our big girl. She is roughly about 500 pounds. She's the biggest cat we have right now. And on the back, I believe it's Keisha running out of the water on vacation. It's a really cool action shot. Um, most of these pictures are Jamie's, which is very cool. So we do kind of features different species um, in different months. So uh, some cats are still with us. Some cats aren't. Oh, I'm sorry. Some well, cats. <laughs> I made really it worse, didn't it? Still. <laughs> um, so some cats are still with us, some of them aren't. We did feature a whole, um, so we got cougars here. Um, we try to do what we can. You can't tell when you know anybody's gonna pass, unfortunately. Um, so leopards here, and then I believe we've got a whole rescue on one of these. But they're it. mostly current cats. There we go, mostly current cats. So we have the whole rescue from October, from last year, the Colorado cats. Um, so it's kind of cool, put them all together. Okay. And then, um, so you can get these. These are great. They feature enrichment. So really fun stuff. Cam with his new ball, <laughs> which he loves. And the Misco in the little box. It's just adorable. So these are so these are 15. And uh, I know we've got a, the online right now is if you order. Today is Thanksgiving. So Thanksgiving through 
Cyber Monday, which would be Monday. Um, if you have an order of $45 or more, not including shipping, you get a free calendar. So get your orders in, get your free calendar. Um, very and cool. even if you have a free calendar, it makes a great gift. Oh, yeah, they're great gifts. I never have to buy another calendar again because I get free calendars all the time, so that's great. Show um, me those games because I'm going to be cutting this down into little separate things for okay. different things. And those okay. games sell great. So okay, i gotta read, yeah. I got to redo these guys, and we'll do the Crazy Cat Lady on the other side, too. That's got a game, too. So this little game is the Wild Animal Opoly, and it's got features all kinds of animals on it. Um, it's basically your Monopoly, but with wild animals, so it's a little bit different. Um, I have not played this one. I am planning on playing this one today with the interns, because uh, we're all going over to um, one of our volunteers. They've uh, graciously offered our, their house to us. We did it last year, so um, this one is basically well, Monopoly based on cats, but Edith tells me she has played this with one of our hospice patients, and instead of collecting houses, you collect litter boxes. <laughs> so I'm, I've got I'm, this horrible glare. I keep moving around. I'm there. keen to play it. Maybe if I don't do an angle. Yeah, is that, that it? Is that better? better? Okay, that's the angle. Um, so yeah, so features all kinds of cats, different uh, breeds, um, and then it's where you regular Monopoly, but it's a little bit different, so it's a little bit fun. This has been super uh exciting and how many popular you sold this i ha okay i ordered i think i regularly ordered 36 we sold those then i ordered 48 they're all gone um now i'm on another 36 so yeah that's where we're at i did not sell this much i sold like 36 in three days and i didn't sell that much all last christmas so i don't know what's going on y'all are crazy about catopoly and I, it's great so i, I have them in hundred I have them in now. I'm going to order more before Christmas. I may just do it tomorrow um, when I'm in. So I'll do that. I'll get them up, uh, updated and we'll have them online as well because I think right now we're at zero because I sold them all. Um, so yeah. Uh, so we got our ball of cats over here. Or... And we've seen all those types of cats? Yep. We've seen all of those. We've got our no humbug in the wild. <laughs> we've got our planet section. We do have cute little things for the house. Um, if you're decorating and you love cats, we have fun little pillows. I guess the cat and I liked it. If you don't speak to your cat about catnip, who will? I they have cannot, that on my They cannot learn this on the streets, people. <laughs> um, and then, where's our therapist? Mm, I don't see the therapist one. Mm. Maybe it's your most popular one. Mm, oh, here it is. My therapist has whiskers. All of my therapists have whiskers. If you're having a bad day, oh, these are 14, I believe. Yep, 14. Um, if you're having a bad day, you go outside and hang out with cats, and it gets much better quickly. So we have a crazy cat corner, crazy cat lady corner. For those of you out there that are crazy cat ladies and not afraid to admit it, um, we have a lunch box, which I wish had a thermos. I think it should come with a grumpy cat thermos, is my personal opinion, um, <laughs> because I think that would be hilarious. But it does not. It does not. And does these it come with are. Anything? No, it just. Well, it comes with a. Um, it's like a sticker that comes with it, and you get this fun little cat in a, in a healing cone. Yeah, that's what it is. Cone of shame. These are 13, and they're your old school metal. What we all grew up with. Here's your official I'm a Crazy Cat Lady sticker. Um, but yeah, these are what we grew up with. Uh, and then for those of you who are my age or older, you remember color forms. That's basically what 20 this is. For older. Yeah, 20. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what we are. We're going to go with that. So color forms. Uh, so you can reuse it. You can dress up as all different things. It comes with hairballs. So I don't know what color forms are. Color forms, they were the little people that you could dress with different stuff. Um, had a little, um, they were like reusable stickers. And you could, they had like little, he had like a little hard hat and then, she, or an overalls and then she had like a little dress and you could change them out and make them different. And they it stick? Was, yeah, and they stick on stuff. I'm way older, so I we know, did not have that. We had like little paper tabs that you had to fold down. That corners. too, we had that too, but this was like the like high tech version of that, I guess. I don't know. Um, so yeah, it features um, hair balls. You can change your face. She can wear sunglasses, all kinds of stuff. She, her name is Kitty. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so it's got a cat carrier. Apparently cats wear unicorn horns for some reason. It's, yeah, it's hilarious. So these are 12, and you can see she's a little stand, and you fold her up. So you could, like, 
put her in her desk and dress her up differently for different things, I guess. Uh, we have Crazy Cat Lady bandages. These are extremely popular. They are $6. I cannot keep them in here. And there's a free prize inside. I have no idea what it is. I have no idea what it is. So it features all kinds of cats. Crazy Cat Lady. Um, so kind of fun. There's 15 um, uh, Band-Aids in there. Bandages. Band-Aid is a... What is the trademark name? I guess I can't say Band-Aid. Uh, if you're very proud of yourself being a crazy cat lady, you can get a band. Uh, you can get a patch, and they are five dollars. Go on your robe. To go on your robe, <laughs> right above the cat. Here I am. Um, and then if you want to, you have little notebooks. There's three different little notebooks in here. I think they are. It's seven dollars for the whole set, and you can keep track of, you know. If you have a sick kitty, you can keep track of stuff with him in there or something like that. Or just random things they do or give them away to friends and family because they're kind of cute and fun. Um, Is that all one book? Yep. It, no, it's all one. It's all one set. Three. So there's, yeah, three books in a set. So it's a, it's a very good deal. Um, then down here we have the Crazy Cat Lady game. Now it's a little more like not Monopoly kind of more like life I guess you're collecting things so the goal is <laughs> to collect the most cats before any crazy cat lady makes it home I have not played this one yet either but there's like 50 different cats you can collect oh my goodness so yeah Does it's it for real cat? crazy cat ladies so a little bit um so you don't have to play in a robe or your pjs like the people in the front but you can if you want um but yeah something a little different it's a little lots of fun so yeah, so I guess this is her stash of cats over here. She's winning. So there's one on here. There's one girl on here that reminds me of Erin. It just cracks me up. You can have your own Crazy Cat Lady action figure, which I think Carol was given not a long time ago <laughs> by, I believe, Howie, if I'm not mistaken. So, yeah, you come out. There's the one in everybody's neighborhood. You know, they. the funny part is she, there's one in her pocket. Oh, was it like Making fun of the okay. fact that he was with a crazy cat lady now. <laughs> uh, so she's even got one in her pocket. So, we got all kinds of stuff. And then we also have the Crazy Cat Lady coloring book, which takes you through all kinds of fun things. I, we had a, a guest in one day, and they were flipping through this. This is $7. And she was flipping through this, and they were just dying laughing. And I was like, you guys are enjoying that way too much. She goes, because it's true. <laughs> and I was like, okay. So, it's, it's got some little games and fun things in it. So, it's kind of funny. Um, if you like adult coloring books, you can have fun with that. And it's uh, $7. And then up above that, we've got our uh, greeting cards. And these all feature our cats. They're quite large. They're blank inside, so you can write whatever you want. You can use them for your uh, Christmas cards. Send those out if you want. You can do that, too. Uh, and then we've also got um, envelopes to fit them. They're only $2, and they're beautiful images of our cats. So you've got Risa on the right over there, TJ the tiger. Armani the Leopard. Somebody sent me the Riza card the other day. Did when they? I opened it up, I was like, this is just beautiful. We should sell these. And I was like, oh, wait a minute. Wait, this, this is our Riza. cat. <laughs> yeah. Uh, got Jumanji here and then Joseph here. Uh, or Cameron here. Sorry. Uh, what's funny is I was I did the Great American Teach-In and Lewis Elementary School has a panther as their mascot. So I'm looking at their, their big... I've got this huge mural and whatever. And I look over and I see this face and I go, I know that face. And they've got a picture because they've sponsored Risa. So they've got their sponsor picture of Risa. And I was like, <laughs> and I walked over and took a picture for Facebook. Because <laughs> I was like, this is great. So now we get into the adult shirts. All of our, almost all of our um, uh, short sleeve shirts are $20. Uh, 22 if it's a large, a uh, double X. So this one is really cool. It doesn't glow in the dark, but it is the coolest because it is all, it's called the text tiger. So it's a tiger made up of words. They did this for a gorilla too, but the tiger is cooler and it's ours. And it has really cool things. And if you look really closely, the, if I can hold it still enough for you, the whiskers are sentences. Oh uh, it says size of den ranges on prey abundance. Tigers roar. Yeah. Tigers roar is to communicate or to scare the crap out of you um night vision in their eyes it talks about their eyesight it says night vision yellow iris binocular vision so it's really kind of cool the ears talk about hearing um solitary hunter so That's it's it's clever. a oh it's a very clever shirt i no love this shirt so, so much oh yeah and it's really soft most of these shirts have a um whatever their finish is it makes it really soft oh they're cool oh, i love them um, then we've got your tribal tiger here. It's really kind of a neat 
And this is, yeah, and this is uh, unisex. A lot of these are unisex. Um, and then uh, these are all $20. Uh, we've got um, uh, 22 for the double X's. This one is kind of fun. It's a biker shirt. Uh, so you've got on the front, you've got Big Cat uh, Cycling, I think is what it says. And it's got our, our establishment dates. A lot of the shirts have that. And then on the back has your cool roaring motors because, you know, lions ride motorcycles. <laughs> but it's cool. We like it. A lot of people like it. Um, and that's got a lion in the background, too. Um, behind it, so that's kind of cool. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah, um, we got this one. If you're a, if you've got a biker in your um, that you're looking for for Christmas, now our long sleeves are a little more expensive. They're 25, 27 if they're a double X. But this is a really popular shirt because it's Harley Davidson colors, so uh. it works. This shirt sells year round. The other cool thing about this shirt, we have the stripes on the sleeves that I can't get to cooperate with me. La la la, there we go. Oh, Got tiger nice. heads on either side. This sleeve too. La la la. Now then the cool deal on the back is this quote, and I love it. Um, and it's very true. Sad but true. When the last individual of a race or living things breathes no more, another heaven and another earth must pass before such a one can be again. William Beebe, 1877 to 1962 threatened by loss of habitat and the use of tiger parts in oriental medicine. Hey, that's new. They added that at the bottom of the, the tiger parts. That's cool. Yeah, because they make tiger bone wine. Um, they use rhino horn too. Um, they make um, oh, they make all kinds of elixirs and things that don't do anything. Uh, the cat is actually more valuable for its parts than it is as a whole. And they tiger farm kind of how we do puppy mills here. They do tiger farming. So not a good process at all we don't we don't like that at all so um, it's a great way to raise awareness about all of that yeah um so this other really cool shirt on this shirt is super soft um it's not super thick so it's kind of your florida oh, long yeah. sleeve oh yeah really this thin. i think just about all the volunteers when this came out they got this shirt so the cool part of this shirt is the back we've got the it's called time honored um and it's got all of our information in 1992 we started um, and then it's got the other, this features the tiger, and then down the sleeve, you've got the really cool font with the oh, 1992. Sweet. Yeah, they're super, super comfy. This one is awesome. And also, that's on the back of the shirt? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What's funny is people will come through and do this all the time, and I'm like, that is not the exciting part of this shirt. <laughs> and I turn it around. <laughs> so they're strategically placed where, like, the back shows here, the front shows over here. If I need it to be different, then I turn one around. This is another really cool shirt that's a new design. Um, another long sleeve. So we got the Big Cat Rescue on there. Got the nice, cool Big Cat Rescue down the sleeve. And then this radial. You guys might have seen pictures on our 25th anniversary. I think for, they were Yep, we were sporting these. They're very popular. Um, and uh, uh, kind, of, kind of a retro. Uh, it's not a vintage fit, so it's a, it's a unisex. Um, and some of the vintage fits are a little bit tighter, a little bit smaller. But these are pretty true to size. And then um, they're super soft and nice and stretchy. They're just great shirts. Again, the, the long sleeves are 25 for um, everything through extra large and then 27 for double X. Um, the other really great new shirts we've got are, these are also really soft here too. Um, this one, it's only on the front, so these are $20 again. It's got the Big Cat Rescue down at the bottom. Really cool lion on the front. Um, what's cool is actually Brittany Mira had a, um, a tank underneath it that was kind of a fuchsia-like color. And when she put it underneath here, it totally brought out the maroonish purple. Oh, really? In the design. I would have never thought of that. And I was like, oh, that's so cool. I'm going to have to check that out. Um, this is one of my new favorite new shirts, too. Uh, this is what the double X looks like. These are all uh, unisex shirts as well. We do have some women's cuts, and I can show you some of those shortly. Um, but it's kind of a rainbow silhouette. Just really kind of neat and cool. Features the lion on the Serengeti. Um, and then... Uh, the other new shirt, it's funny because some people either love this one and hate the other one or hate the other, or hate, love that one and hate this one. I don't know, it's weird. Um, and then this one is Tiger Stripes. So you got to look closely to see what's going on, but it's kind of cool. So you've got the Tiger Stripes going on, which you see, but then at the bottom you've got the silhouette of the cat. Okay. So it's a little more subtle. So it's kind of a neat, kind of a neat uh, deal. So we do, if you're looking for the bright t-shirt, you got somebody with a bright personality. <laughs> 
This is the tiger with the uh, sunglasses on. I can't, this shirt, I can't keep in either. It's got the nice big, big cat rescue down at the bottom. Um, uh, over here we have some women's designs. Oh, did I just knock it off? I did. These are some of the women's cuts. So it's got a scoop neck, so it doesn't fit quite as tight. Um, and it says, get it under the light a little bit better, wild at heart. Uh, live free and it's got the big cat rescue there so it features some uh, animal patternage doesn't really have a picture of a cat or anything but it's really cool it's selling really well and it's a beautiful color and it's got that um, it's kind of that burnout uh, design so it's not super thick not super heavy or anything like that so it's a really nice light shirt and then this one will always be a great seller no matter what <laughs> um, this is, we've got a v-neck, we have this in purple and the charcoal, um, it's, we also, also offer it online with multiple choices, so you can, men can get it too, uh, different colorage and all that kind of stuff, but this was the first one we did, Jamie designed this shirt, it's beautiful, um, it's actually China doll in the picture, um, and then, uh, she's got the bright colors in there, so on the online exclusives, you can get it with blue down here, but if it's blue here, it's also gonna have a blue eye, so, it, uh, you know, it matches, and then, it's just really kind of cool um, came out nice uh, we do have a scoop neck and more v-necks with multiple colors on this because we can offer a lot more there um, that is a third party and they print them as they're ordered and it also goes up in size as well some of them it goes all the way up to like 5x um, which I just don't have the space for in here I know we have a lot of space but we don't have all the space um, but they can do it as it's printed or as it's ordered so it's a little bit easier it takes a little bit longer to get it from them but um, if you're patient and you go ahead and order now, you should be fine. Um, it's about so, two weeks, I think. From yeah, it's roughly two weeks. Then. And uh, there's a lot of different color variations of that. So it really allows us to offer a broader, I can't have six colors of one shirt. That just isn't going to work. Um, this is my most popular shirt, period. Um, so if you have... I can't believe this became your most popular seller. Do you I, not I listen to all of the conversations shirt. we have? <laughs> Have you not heard every conversation in the world we have here is about poop? So, Indeed. So it's kind of a takeoff on um, Guinness, but that's okay. They're not angry about that. So it's very cool in front. The best part is the back of the shirt. So if you have a guy that, or a girl, whatever, that likes tongue-in-cheek humor, and poop is always funny, except to Carol. Um, <laughs> we talk about poop all the time, but it's, you know, it's got a distinct aroma. I, trust me, tiger poop definitely has a distinct aroma. Um, it is brewed daily. It is extra dark sometimes. Um, and let's see, what does it say? It tastes like crap? Yeah, I don't taste it. I just know it smells like crap. Warm and refreshing. It's warm and refreshing. <laughs> yeah, it's hilarious. It's hilarious. Um, and they are all natural ingredients. So we do hear, it's funny, I'll be, I'll be working and I'll hear somebody and I know what shirt they picked up by how hard they're laughing. I'm like, oh, yep, they're, uh -huh, they've got the tiger poop shirt on. Or they're looking at that one. So here's the purple version of the um, China Doll Tea. So if you like purple. Gail, I do. Uh, people who love purple. Um, uh, we do have, uh, for things around the office, if you're looking for some cool stuff. Uh, we don't have, whoa, where did it go? I thought I had more. Oh, they're up here. Where did my others go? It's sold out. No, I just moved. I don't think they sold out. I mean, you sold off your little rack there. Yeah, you, you know. You wouldn't put a rack out with nothing on you it. You know, the one thing I don't like about the new system is it doesn't alert me when things are getting low. And the old one did. And I'm like, oh, this is so annoying. So I don't know when it's gone. Uh, but we do have mouse pads that feature some of our cats. Really cool Hoover, if you're a fan of Hoover. These are all $12. Um, some past cats, but we're going to be making some more once we sell these guys out. That's uh, Windstar. Um, and then Cameron down here. But yeah, if you want to be cool at work and have a cat on your office, on your desk, you can do that. Mm -hmm. uh, this banjo. These are the old style. If you're a fan of bear cats, banjo. I bet Sarah Dupree has one of these. Because <laughs> she loves those little guys. Um, and then we have some really cool uh, little coin purses that have uh, lions, tigers, and leopards on them. And the cool thing about the new ones, that one doesn't have it, is it has a little big cat rescue tag. Oh, I should probably turn it this way. That makes sense. So these are $5. They're actually a really good size for your earbuds, your, um, if you're traveling for your, um, your plug-in for your phones or whatever. Uh, we can't, right before uh, Angie and I went to Disney, she grabbed one of these. She was like, oh, the perfect size. Yeah, it's really good size for that. Yeah. And, you and then you just put it in your bag. <laughs> yeah. 
True, you could do that. You could, that's why you need the whole set. That's right. And then you just throw it in your bag. So these are really kind of neat as part of our fair trade um, items that we have. They are um, made from recycled um, palm fronds. And they're made in the Philippines. Oh, yeah. So uh, to dye them, well, they dry them out. They wash them in the river, and then they let them dry out, and then they naturally dye them. So we have the little marmalade. So if you're a fan of cola marmalade, you can have a marmalade. Um, you can also have him as a an ornament that's hanging over there, but this is the bigger version. And they are $11. And they're, like, really stiff. Yeah, they're stiff. They're really cool. <laughs> when I had the bigger ones, people go, are you supposed to clean your feet with these? I'm like, please don't. <laughs> Please do not do that. It's, no, that's not funny. So the little ornaments, we've got a little tiger. The lion is my favorite one. Um, we've got a little black kitty. Um, we've got little, if you like, Siamese. All the ornaments are $8. And then my favorite is the little lion. Oh, look look how cute why. he is. Oh, my gosh. He's adorable. <laughs> so he is $8 as well. Oh, yeah. Impressive. So they're so cute. So, and so you're not only basket. supporting our cats, you're supporting... Yes, so it's, um, it's fair trade, so it helps uh, the community, the indigenous people that make it there. Um, I really think the Snow Leopard Trust started kind of the whole fair trade thing um, uh, with their work 30 years ago because they started trying to offer something that the indigenous people were making that we would want that would help offset their um, losses or augment their... Uh, income so it's great and i think that kind of paved the way for the others uh, we also have some really cool coasters we've got a rasta lion these guys are eleven dollars a set do we have that on a shirt we do not have this on a shirt we have it on other things i'm thinking about getting the shirt too um but of course it'll be a black shirt and jamie's like no, no black, more black shirt. shirts <laughs> yes so i have the battle between you and her so it's loads of fun um we have this one and then we also have the tiger poop version as well because those are lions. Yeah, these are uh, king of cards, so they're the lions. Although lions are technically not the king, because the king of the jungle is the misnomer. It should be king of the grasslands, but apparently that didn't sound king good. Of beasts. <laughs> yeah, well, but they're not the biggest. They just have the biggest mane. Technically, if you were going with king of beasts, it would be Siberian tigers. So then we also have the tiger poop here. <laughs> As a coaster. Yeah, so you can put your real beer on your tiger poop beer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it works out well. Don't um, confuse it with your tiger poop. No, do not do that. So we have a variety of mugs. Uh, some feature our cats like these. These are the little bobcats. These are all photos Jamie has taken and they feature some of our cats have their names below it. Um, so if you're a big fan of bobcats, which I know Jamie and Carol both are because they both like bobcats a lot. Um, you can do that. We also have uh, are bobcats again. Where's our tigers? Oh, I'm missing them. Mostly bobcats out here. So we have our campfire mugs. These weigh a pound. They are $10. These are nice and heavy. Um, they are really great mugs, but they kind of remind you of camping from when you were a kid. Uh, they're very popular. We have that in almond and in white. Uh, we have the mugs where Joseph made his painting. So it fe features a picture of Joseph and then his lovely painting. That's beautiful. Yeah. So really kind of cool. Um, what else do we have? We've got the snow leopard chest mugs. Uh, we still, even though we don't have snow leopards anymore, we still support the snow leopard chest because they're doing some amazing work all over the world where snow leopards live. Um, they're the only people doing it, really. And that cat's on the both sides. Cat's on both sides. Tail. Yeah, the tail's missing. Yeah, tails meet. And it has their website there. And it's this beautiful huge. green color inside. And they are 10, I believe, 13. And then... Um, we have lots of other drinkware. We kind of restock, apparently. Um, this is the Tex Tiger again. Hopefully, it's not going to glare on you, but it probably will if I do straight up and down. Yeah, so you can read these nice up close and personal without like sticking your face in somebody's chest, <laughs> which is highly inappropriate. Um, so, and these are similar to Tervis tumblers. They're going to keep it hot or cold. Um, they are fifteen, I believe. Yes, and uh, they are dishwasher safe, I believe. Then we also have the Rasta Lion. It says so. I think it does. It say so. Well, it says so on your sign. Dishwasher safe. Haha, <laughs> Look, the thing says too. Okay, I can read. Um, again, center for good. Can't read good. Um, Rasta Lion over here too. Also says Big Cat Rescue down in the corner. Um, so if those of you who like the lions, we've also got a beer mug down here that also features the Rasta Lion. It's a um, it's a frosted, so it's a little bit different. Uh, and these are eighteen. The travel mugs, 
12. I saw the 18 ounces, not the what it was. Um, so these are nice, and if you like the silver, you like the old kind of thermos look to it. Cause my dad had a, what was his thermos called? I can't remember. This is green, Stanley, Stanley thermos. Oh, I drank out of that thing forever. Um, they're almost indestructible. And then we've got our other little tumbler that's clear. This one is not dishwasher safe. You gotta hand wash this one. And I believe it is $15. So it's the same kind of thing, keep it warm, cold, that kind of deal, because that's all the rage now. Uh, we've got a couple of uh, shot glasses. I just realized yesterday I have to reorder the short one. Um, so I've got this little kind of vintage lion version. It's seven, the talls are five, and then we have a short version of this one, um, and it's 350, but I gotta get those in again. So don't want that one yet. Uh, for those of you who are traveling and you want your luggage to look different from everybody else's, we have lovely luggage tags. Uh, we had several people who came in for the um, walkabout and they were like, oh, we had these on our luggage and everybody was like, those are so cool. Um, but it makes it real easy when you get a tiger hanging off of your luggage to tell. If you have black luggage, everyone has black luggage. So that's what I've discovered I traveling. just mm -hmm. bought black luggage for Hallie I was and like, I was oh. like, gosh, that was stupid. <laughs> I know, I thought the same thing when I did it and I was like, oh no. So these are $3 a piece. That's Keisha. We've got Sunny over here, Sundari. Um, so Lauren should have one. We've got Nabisco over here. He's a little sideways, but he's adorable. Uh, Zabu, uh, one of our past kitties, Canyon, right there, if you're a Sandcat fan. Zabu again, because you can't escape her. Uh, Joseph and the Cougar Cubs. So we've got a good variety of them. Um, same thing with the magnets. They all feature our cats as well. We've got, ton not magnets, uh, keychains. We've got tons and tons of those. They're all $3. So if you had a favorite cat, we have a favorite species. We've got loads of them. Feel free to um, peruse our website for those. We're trying to feature some of the younger kitties because as a geriatric home for cats, it makes it a little bit, you know, tough to feature everybody. But if we can get the younger ones, hopefully we can and so many those pictures longer. People had such a connection to cats who have passed that mm -hmm. they want to remember them by keeping their... Yep. Well, this is one of my personal favorites, Mr. Cody. He was a scary boy. That's why I loved him. Uh, some have really sweet personalities and everybody loves them. I tend to like the more aggressive cats because... You like the bad boys. They're just, you know, whatever. <laughs> I just, I've always liked tigers. Tigers are scary. Except for when they're Bengali or Snorkel. Then they're not scary. Well, unless Ben had red meat, then he could be scary. Really? Yeah. So... <laughs> So uh, Chelsea had fed him one day and he had red meat. She goes, he roared at me. And I went, well, he does have that ability. She's like, he's never done that before. I said, did he have red meat? She goes, yeah. I was like, that's why. He didn't want you to touch his red. He was like, nope, you can't have it back. So we also feature our cats on some ornaments. We have uh, snow snowflake ornaments. The one that's missing is actually China doll with the Santa hat on. We'll be getting those in again. They're very popular. So you've got little Mr. Tut. So if you're a fan of King Tut, you can have King Tut on your Christmas tree. Cute little Nabisco again. If you're a fan of Artemis, this is Artemis. And Windstar. And Cameron. And the funny part is Jamie doesn't, she's, you know, that's not one of her favorite pictures, but everybody loves it because it's just so funny. He was in a yawn and then he pulled back in <laughs> and she got the picture and it's just great. So Nirvana, if you're a big fan of Nirvana, you can have her on your tree. If you're a fan of ocelots, we've also got um, perfection on the end. So she's our current ocelot. She has such a pretty little face, but you'll never see it because she's so shy. And they are $3, three dollars, three fifty. Um, we have all kinds of whimsical, uh, jewelry that many of our volunteers make. Jamie makes some of it too. Hers is not as whimsical. Hers is like pictures of the cats. So it's really cool. Um, Just the bracelet. The bracelet. Uh, normally I have one on, but I didn't put it on today. I do. So uh, Carol, Carol has all the bracelets <laughs> on. Okay. So we've got the big cat rescue here and they're, and they're not embossed with their stamps. So they last longer and it's got paw prints all the way around. These are $2 um, and 50 cents. And it's a good way to just wear us on your wrist. I was actually at a U2 concert and I, I always wear mine facing me because I'm, you know, I like it. Nah, nah. Anyway, um, a lot of people wear them facing other people so they can read it or whatever. And this girl goes, oh, Big Cat Rescue, I know, I've been there. I did it. And so I started a whole conversation and I'm like, okay, yeah, sure, whatever. It was so funny because I, I didn't think anybody was going to notice it, but I mean, we're waiting to see U2. So, uh, so, and we were on the floor right in front of them. It was awesome. Sorry, I just have to get that in there. 
Um, are these things available on the store? These, yes, these are as well. Um, people probably haven't found them as much because um, there's some of the same designs as some of our shirts. So you've got the cat wearing the sunglasses. you got the little Rasta. And the, some of these, he's got glasses on the zebras in the thing. Um, <laughs> so yeah, because it's his prey. If you're a big fan of Iron Man, you can have your Iron Mane. Uh, these were kind of fun. I thought they would do well. Mm, not as much, but if you're kind of a, you know, li different little whatever, you know, go for it. Uh, we've got some stickers too. Um, How much were those? Those are $4. All of them? Yes, they're all four. Uh, that one is the Lion Tiger Overlay. So it's got kind of both got the tiger on top and the lion on the bottom. It's kind of neat. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and then we've got magnets as well on the side. Oh, you want the stickers back or what? No. Yeah. So the Keep Calm and Big Cat Rescue. People like that one a lot. And then, of course, you've got him with the zebras in his eyes again. It's a little bit different. So this is my favorite um, magnet that's not a cat because I'm a nerd. So <laughs> I think it's great. I see lions periodically. <laughs> that's a really thick magnet. Yeah, they are quite thick. They're um, they're five dollars. They stand out off of your off of you know whatever they're attached to. So we've got a couple different designs. Got the super mane again. Got the uh, all the different animals in the mane, which is kind of nifty to make up the mane. Well, isn't that clever? Yeah, and then we've got like the um, silhouette of what lives out in the African uh, Serengeti. Uh, we've got Iron Mane too, because you can't have DC without um, uh, Marvel. Uh, we've got the Rasta lion again. And we've also got the, um, the overlay of the lion and tiger. And then this one seems to be the most popular, which I find hilarious. I do wish it was a slightly different background that. because you can't, the cat doesn't stand out as much because he's, you know, if he was a black cat, it'd be a little bit or something. But anyway, people love it because it's your whole, this is how, who I am. <laughs> this is how I see myself. So it's kind of fun. Um, if you want to show us off on your car, you can do that too. Uh, we've got um, vanity license plates and they feature our cats. They're all $8. Uh, we've got little genie here. Windstar again. If you're a fan of Skipper, we got Skipper down there. He's one of our Canadian Lynx, Mr. Fluffy himself. He's a very handsome cat, very serious. I am he, I'm not one of his favorite people, so it's always interesting when I go over there. And the reason I'm not one of his favorite people is because I helped keep him alive, and he did not like that. Um, we had to force feed him for a while when he had his big surgery, and uh, yeah, he, he did not see me as a friend. When you're kind of shoving food with the syringe pole into their face, they don't so much like that. Uh, Keisha's the lion or the tiger that's featured. Joseph is the lion featured, uh, and then we've got Simba down here, Simba leopard, and saber uh, leopard down there. So again, some pass guys, but it's not going to hurt if you're a leopard fan. You can you can show them too. Um, we, I'm waiting on some of these to come back in. This is one of our most popular. Uh, tanks it's a racerback tank so kind of cool and different and it's got features a leopard on it which we don't have that much stuff that features leopards and then it's got the really cool um font for the big cat rescue and these i can't keep in the store so right now i'm low, a little low but i'm waiting for it to come back in it's on order should be in soon um and then these are the leftovers we only have four left over from the walkabout the actual get them um, now. <laughs> the actual event um you can get some more online with different colors and stuff but this was the actual shirt that was here the day of the event um we've also got some sparkly tees over here the tanks on the other side the tanks are all 18 uh 20 for the double x's i believe um so they feature snow leopards and leopards and then um these are our blingy and these are like a thicker material, I think. Yeah, they're a thicker tank. That one, the racerback is much thinner. Well, that um, really shows off when you move the cat there. So sparkly. Yeah. Oh, that's so pretty. Yeah. Can you do that snow leopard? Yep. Oh, sure. Make it Wish big. the 3D did that. Yeah. <laughs> it didn't, but that's okay. Um, also, something cool that we do during this time of the year, do a couple of different uh, programs. So you guys know we do some um, uh, seasonal enrichment for our cats this way so I can do the Van and White. Um, seasonal Richard Park So for, you know, uh, Halloween, we do the, the pumpkins. Well, for Thanksgiving and Christmas, we give them turkeys. So what I do, first of November, so we put the Christmas trees up. I know, everybody does it. Um, but we offer what we call cat angels. 
And so you can, it helps purchase turkeys for our cats. So for the smaller guys, they get um, roaster hens. Uh, the, the leopards and cougars get half turkeys. And the big guys, the lions and tigers, get um, uh, whole turkeys. So what you would do is you would pick who you want. If you want an ocelot, you grab this, you take it up there. You're going to pay for Perfections Cornish Game Hen. So we can fill this out for you. You can actually hang this on your, um, on your tree. And Barb is now doing it. So we've got some glitter going on here. I do not have time to do that. Barb is a scrapbooker, so she knows what she's doing. So they're adorable now. I was like, oh, that's great. You can do that for the rest of, yes, that is your project now. So, um, so do you need a good copy for our tree and for the No, so they can take it home and then what they get, I have you walk over here. This is our version of Jerry's kids kind of thing. So then we fill out a paw print and we put it around our, our doorway. We're gonna put it, we'll have to expand because people have been doing a lot. We had one gentleman who every, for the past two years, he's bought a turkey for every cat on the property, which is just amazing. I mean, it's great. We do, we make sure they all get one too, but then, and I'm like, okay, sure. So it's just incredible. He doesn't want this. He doesn't want anything like that. So, you know, it's people just do some really cool stuff. Um, but, yeah, so it's kind of our little version. You can take it and put it home. People do it every year, or they get specific cats each year, or they get a specific species, or whatever. And then we put the prop ramps up and, and help uh, kind of, like, encourage other people to do it. The other thing we do, um, so we get to decorate our tree. We explain it with our nice little fun sign back here which just makes me laugh at the coyote holding the turkey. That, that clip art just makes me laugh hysterically. <laughs> it's, I'm very simple. Um, so uh, Bridget, one of our newer volunteers, last year very kindly made us a tree skirt that she glued each one of these little pom-poms on. And then she left them for her cats to play with, which was great. She also wrapped the boxes. They are wrapped from our couples to each other or from uh, so-and-so to Santa to so-and-so. Um, Max gave Marianne, Cam gave Boo, um, so it's really cute. So I just saved them and used them again this year. The other thing we do is we do a Toys for Tots. So if you buy any of our stuffed animals, um, which are, um, we usually, we're, we're focusing on the, the smaller ones, but if you wanna buy the $15 ones, that's fine too. And then we have people donate them in this bin, and I figure out where they're collecting um, during uh, the season. They usually they collect around the 18th or so this, so they can start getting everything out to the families. So uh, I start in November, so I get a whole month instead of half of a month to, to do. And you can look inside. We do have some stuffies. Some of them have some Christmas ribbon on them and everything. I don't know if you'll be able to see. <laughs> maybe I need to take this off so you can see. Yeah, there we go. Oh, wow. You got like yeah. maybe over, not quite half a box. Yeah. So usually we fill it up and then some. Um, and then we did do this because people were taking them out to look at them and we're like, yeah, no, they're not for sale. They're for going somewhere else. But it's a neat way to help two charities at the same time. You help us and then we get to help give it away with uh, Toys for Tots. So nice. very, very cool thing to do. Um, let's see what else. What other cool things? Oh, um, the Snow Leopard Trust. Since we talked about them, we should stop by them. But you I gotta move kick all, all those boxes out of there. I know, I gotta move all the boxes. You love chocolate and honey. So the Snow Leopard Trust, they are an amazing um, entity. They are a nonprofit that specifically helps to save snow leopards in the wild. So they set up um, camera traps. They're the people, um, they're the reason we know what average home ranges are. And up until 2010, nobody did because these are cats that live in the Himalayas. Not a whole lot of people going to the Himalayas to study leopards. Um, they've gone from telemetry collars, the radio collars, uh, where you had to listen with a with a, a antenna. <laughs> I'm like, what is the word I'm looking for? And of course, they can jump <laughs> chasms. So now they're on a different mountain range, and you're going. I don't hear them anymore, <laughs> so you gotta go back. So now they have GPS collars, which are great. We actually sponsored a GPS collar. Um, I believe they're about five thousand dollars or so. And uh, as an entity, Big Cat Rescue sponsored one of their collars, and so we got information on that cat and what it was doing and how they can track it. Um, they stay on for a year, and then they, when they fall off, they go and collect it and get all get more of the 
information off. They do uh, quarterly take information off of them as well, depending on weather, obviously. Um, we usually have a little video here playing yep. when the store is open that yep. shows those video, those camera trap images so that people know what it is that they're sponsoring. Yeah, and, and it's really cool because they'll set them up inside rocks and the cats will walk right up to them. Um, or they'll walk past them or whatever. And so uh, a lot of what Jamie does with our rehab kitten uh, bobcats is she'll take pictures of their legs because that's usually what you're seeing on a trap if they walk by. And then the, the markings are still completely... Um, individual on the legs too so they do that they can tell which cats are coming by and they can track that um, so if you don't know what a snow leopard looks like this is a mom and a cub um, we've got these cub cards I believe they're eight dollars they feature a couple of different ver different um, images cute Explain little cub how the money is how this how does oh how does art how, how our tell it? yeah okay so what happens is we purchase um, stuff to sell and um from what we purchase the money well it starts the other way around but the money goes to the indigenous people who make things like these yaki sacks they're made out of yak um wool and they've got uh, sand inside of them so if you're a hacky sack person this will smell really interesting it's also a good toy for a cat to play with um it does not smell like anything they've ever smelled these are i believe five dollars six dollars um, and then they have yarn. The yarn is camel uh, wool. So what happens is they'll make these products. We purchase them. Then we sell it to, uh, you know, you guys. Um, and that helps us. Uh, us purchasing it helps the Snow Leopard Trust deal with um, what they're doing in country. Uh, and them purchasing it from the uh, individual people help them make more money. Uh, what was happening is their, their nomadic farmers... Uh, herders, sorry, not farmers, and they would make about three hundred dollars a year. So if a snow leopard took one of their um, one of their flock, that's a big blow. Uh, but them making these kinds of things, they're supplementing their income. The snow leopard trust has also asked. They actually were really intelligent. They went and they talked to the communities and they said, "What do you need?" Instead of a bunch of Americans going, "You shouldn't do this," they walked in and said, "What do you guys need?" So they wanted to vaccinate their flocks. They wanted to insure their flocks, things like that. So they've started doing that. This is a different company, but really cool stuff. Um, uh, if you are interested in wildlife animals on your necklaces, these are a really neat company to do that with. Uh, we've got cat toys down there. They're mice. There's big mice and little mice. Um, they're all handmade, so they all look a little different. Um, and cats either destroy them immediately or carry them around for months on end. That is what I have heard from people. Um, that little guy, they're up here too. Hand, hand me that one, Carol. So if you want to see Does how... Does not belong down here? Yeah, that, well, he probably called that. So if you want to see how different they all look, because they are completely handmade, this is the perfect way to do it. So these are little ornaments, but they're also, Jamie says, cat toys, because Tigre stole it off the tree and wouldn't let it go. <laughs> so you can see how different their faces look, which is kind of like, you know, stone leopards. Get that out of the way. Um, you can see how different the spotting is, the feet look different, you know, they're fatter, they're skinnier, they're shorter. The tail is actually correct. It is the length of the cat, which is correct. They would know. They live where they are. Um, they smell really weird. Um, Mongolian sheep, things like that, so it's going to smell very different, so your cat's going to like it. These are $10. They are an ornament or a cat toy, um, and they look like the little snow leopards, so they're kind of cool and different. Um, so... Very, 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 very interesting. But yeah, they actually went in, and they're the reason we know so much about these guys. But that is a huge predator to not know anything about up until 2010. I mean, that's that's phenomenal. Uh, we are actually their number two buyer in the entire country, even though we don't have snow leopards. I'm very proud of that. Um, they, uh, the Woodland Park Zoo is the only one that buys more than we do, and they do have snow leopards. But we had three. I knew two of them. I knew um, Hercules and Chloe, and uh, they were absolutely amazing. If you want to talk about really pardon the pun, cool cats. They totally are. They are very different than any other species. They're just amazing. Very popular hat. A lot of us have that and wear it around. And it helps. Yeah, I see a lot of you guys us. wearing that. Yeah. And the way this program works is that they have the entire community participating. Mm -hmm. So the idea is that as long as they don't lose any snow leopards in their range, they're allowed to continue to participate in this program where they make a whole lot more money than mm -hmm. the neighbors would make. So it makes everybody a wildlife ranger. Well, what was happening before is if they, if they lost a flock to a snow leopard, they would go and kill, a, it didn't even have to be the same snow leopard, but if they went and killed that snow leopard, brought that pelt down, 
that pelt would feed their entire family for a year. So it made a lot of sense for them to go after the snow leopard. Well now, through this, like Carol was saying, they're making way more than that, so that doesn't make any sense anymore. So it's been a phenomenal thing. The really cool thing about this bag, not only does it feature a snow leopard, but it's made out of recycled bottles. No way. Yeah, so it's really cool. Really? I believe What's it's feel like? Yeah, I believe it's 22. Is it, it feels No, it feels like canvas, but huh. it's not. I believe it's 22. Where'd my sign go? 20. So yeah, these are really cool. Different, it's got their, it's got their website on there too. We don't mind, you know, not everything is gonna have us on there. We're gonna support people that are doing really good work all over the world. Of course, our in-situ wall that we saw a little bit of earlier by the Christmas tree tells you all about that. If you check our site that has that, we'll even support local people that do really nice things, like our honey. <laughs> not to promote myself, but you know. <laughs> And I don't have my name tag on today because it's Thanksgiving and nobody's here. Um, and I got to reorder this too. But Urban Buzz is a local company and they uh, save honeybees, which is very important because they are the ones that are pollinating everything. If you eat food, think a bee. So um, they're helping all the farmers and everything. Um, so it's really great that they uh, will save bumblebees. But this is local honey. It's raw, so if you're allergic to bee stings, Maybe it's not for you um, because it hasn't been pasteurized. Um, and these are But a uh, really good thing 16. about honey is that if it's local like that, if you have allergies. Mm -hmm. It helps. It helps you. I have the little ones and they're not up here either. That's why I got to reorder. But Carol made a big sign. So what happened is we had um, some beehives that were causing some trouble for us. But we didn't want to get rid of the bees because bees are good. As long as they're not Africanized, they're great. So they came out and re... Um, rehomed our bees <laughs> and uh, so we decided that we would thank them and sell their honey so as expensive as it is it still sells really well we have a cute little hex jar too that I got to reorder and it's only like two and a half ounces so um, and then we also support the endangered species um, they make chocolate best uh, chocolate oh, in the it's so world. good <laughs> it does not taste like Hershey's um, it's a little more expensive they're five dollars a bar um, we don't offer this one online because it's food, so you have to you have to come in person and get this one. Um, uh, and then it's all different kinds of flavors. Uh, they've got a lot of cocoa in them, so definitely don't let your animals get that. Cocoa is bad for them, but uh, it's much it's much better for people. It's dark chocolate is better for people too. Uh, it's vegan friendly. It's obviously vegetarian if it's vegan. Um, so it's really good stuff, and it helps support those different um, endangered species as well. Then are we these have the same cats that are videos that the cats watch in the hospital? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Some of them are. The ones at the bottom, of course, aren't. Um, the Paw Project talks about how bad declawing is, and it's actually illegal to, claw, to declaw um, uh, exotic cats. It's becoming illegal to declaw domestic cats in some places, which is great, because you're basically taking your first digit, uh, the first part of your, first, of your digits, um, and that's just not a nice happy fun thing at all uh, and then the two videos down below are talking about how bad the problem is with people owning these things as pets uh, the one on the left the tiger next door um, I have seen that one I still haven't seen the elephant in the living room oh you um, gotta watch it yeah and I'm not sure I can handle that one part yeah it's bad because the cove was like that too I was oh but um, the one on the left the tiger next door is a gentleman um, we, we had a cat I can't remember which cat sure, it was fun. Was it Con? Oh, it was Con. Oh, I should know that. Um, Con came from him, but this is, he's being um, basically threatened with being shut down unless he gets rid of some of his tigers and everything. So there's this one that really made an impression with me. Her name is Tazzy, and it shows them having people look at the cats to then take them off his hand. So he's basically like selling the cats. So it's not like they're going anywhere better. Well, hopefully it's better. And she's really agitated. And she comes around and she hits the side of the fence. Now, the fence is chain link fence. Number one, doesn't do squat for cat, for tigers. Um, and they're panels. And so he's got like a door panel and then like a longer panel. They are, I think, taller than eight feet, which is impressive because most places aren't. Which I'm like, oh, cats can go over that. Um, and she hits it and it pops apart. Like this far apart. You but know, a head and a paw can fit through that. And, she, and I'm just like, oh! I was she's like, so oh my God. She oh, she doesn't it. even realize that she could, like, get out. And I'm just like, oh, somebody's going to die. I'm going to watch a person die right here on the film. And he doesn't. But I was just like, oh, 
for the love of God. No. See, this is why people don't need to have them. Because they yeah, keep them in dog runs. I'm like, I can't even stand that people keep dogs in dog runs. Much less tigers. So, it's crazy. Oh, other sucking suffers. <laughs> Socks. Um, the socks are crazy. Those are stocking suckers. These are stocking suckers, yes. <laughs> Those are stocking they, they are that too. Um, so we have short and long. Uh, the long ones, I believe, are $10. And the shorter ones, I believe, went up to 10 as well. I think the more expensive ones are the uh, long, long, long ones. These went up to 15 There we go. So they feature all kinds of different oh, those species. Are long. Those are like yeah, leggings. yeah. So most of the people out here, if they're the the keepers, if they're wearing um, wellies or rain boots for Americans, wellies for international, um, they get those because they're like knee high, and so they come up high enough that your legs don't get rubbed. Um, but if you're a big fan of tigers, you can get all kinds of information about them here. If you like lions, you can do lions here. Um, on the other side, we've got the shorter crews. Um, the, also kind of leopards. Yeah, the ones that don't. Um, Snow leopards. Like the no-show, a little bit more of the no-show. You know what? I don't like where you are. I'm going to move you. Um, yes, I do. So different species here as well. And you can kind of even got a little domestic down on the bottom. Um, but they're mostly exotics, and uh, most of us have some of these socks. Uh, if it's a really rainy day and somebody didn't bring a change of socks, you will be very surprised at how many pairs of socks have a sell to volunteers. Because <laughs> there's nothing like working not in wet socks. socks. Man, yeah. I hate that. <laughs> no, having, having wet feet are, ugh, it's terrible. It's not good. So then if you move over to the little pillar, we've got some of our own magnets of our cats. And they are all two, three dollars. Trying to remember. So these feature our kids, two dollars. I was right the first time. So we've got Chitaro at the top, a logo there, then Nikita as an adult, um, uh, Cameron, uh, um, I almost said Peru. <laughs> <laughs> I know what I was thinking. Cameron again, and then that skipper down at the bottom, Mr. Handsome Boy. Um, we sell so posters? We do sell posters. These are the old posters. They probably won't be selling them for too much longer. And I don't have the big version. It's downstairs. Um, but these are the ones we did the furball way back when that have oh, con as the stained glass. Yeah. So um, we got a couple bags over here. These are, um, you can take them to the grocery store. They don't have a lot of gusset, but you can definitely carry them around and show them off to you. Yeah, big guy rescue, I'm recycling, blah, 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 kind of thing. Um, Transylvanian fans, look so we'll at the blah, blah, blah. blah. <laughs> well, I have a green one too, but the design is the, just the thing. So this is, those are, I think are five. These are one of our more popular bags. It's actually got quite a lot of room. It's a messenger bag, won't stay. And you can make it go all the way across your body or just carry it, you know, on one arm thing will stop so it has quite a bit of room it's thirty dollars and it's funny when people buy stuff and i just go can i put all your stuff in the bag yeah sure and i just keep filling and filling and they're like it holds that much yeah and then it's got a you know for smaller things you've got your little flap here for that as well and it's but got yeah. like a nice heavy duty canvas yeah it's a nice there. canvas yeah it's a nice it's a really good bag and um, then it's showing how those little things snap there just like that. that yep just like that and then we've got your I'm going on a picnic tote, and it is tiger colors, obviously. <laughs> so, um, oh, it, it's got like a little side pouch. Yeah, it's, it's 15, so it's got a little side pouch here. Um, and then inside, it's got... Because you know, you don't want to put your phone in there, and it's going to be the gonna, very bottom yeah, thing. You're never going to find it. Exactly. So, and then it's got a bit of a gusset in the middle, so you can carry, you know, a fair amount of stuff in there. And it's a zipper. And it's got a zipper. It's only 15, so it's not super outrageously ridiculously expensive or anything like that um and then that's the same one with yep same bag as the other uh yeah we've got a couple more magnets over here a little bit uh different version uh this is the snow leopard trust um get off my tail which i find hilarious this one is seven i think these are five i can't remember two <laughs> not even close um, so this one is actually helping you remind you of cat laws and the things that Carol has been working on for years and years and years and that we're eventually going to get changed um, so you guys can be their voice. This is TJ who was our, our aquatic tiger. He loved playing in his pool. Um, Cameron just lying around. 
Um, and then we've got some of our couples, some of our groups. For those of you who are new to Big Cat Rescue, this is actually Joseph's pride. He actually came with three other cats, two, uh, two tigers and a, uh, another lioness. And so we called it Joseph's pride. And so that's what that is an image of. Um, we've got, I thought we had our couples too. Don't have them out here. Uh, we do have a new one that Jamie designed. It's really cool. It's our 25th anniversary. So get it this year while it's hot. Um, <laughs> while, so, it's while it's relevant. <laughs> Uh, but it features a lot of our different cats, uh, some uh, more uh, recent rescues with Zucari and Nabisco. Mm -hmm. um, and then, of course, Boo Boo. My favorite part is the little paw print in the five. I mean, my favorite part is the pictures of the cats, but I think that's clever. I like that, too. <laughs> and, of course, she threw Pharaoh on there because she loves Pharaoh. Pharaoh does not love me. Uh, for colder weather climates, we did a couple uh, women's, another women's shirt. Sorry, I'm backtracking a little bit. Is this. It's got a V-neck. It's got a little bit more of a, cut, uh, a women's cut. And it features a lion. It's called the Lion Outburst. Um, I wish the eye showed up a tiny bit better, but you get the idea. And then we, for our nerdy fans out there, we've got the IC Lions periodically in a shirt. This is also very soft and feels really good. And very um, popular. Yeah, very popular. Uh, the throwback tees. We got the vintage baseball um, uh, you called shirt. It a throwback tee. Yeah, throwback. I've never like, heard that. Vintage baseball. You know. I grew up where my dad had these. It was a girl date me. I'm in the 70s. Um, and then another cool little feature on the back is the BCR. So, and then for cold weather, uh, although not very cold, even though these are made in Colorado, I don't get it. Nobody's making thick sweatshirts anymore. I don't know they why. They go through cycles. I guess. I'm like, wh what are people, are they wearing five sweatshirts? I mean, they're really not thick. So these yeah. are like Florida sweatshirts, which is great for us. Um, but just kind of weird. I think it's just because of all the like compression shirts and everything. You can keep it close. You don't have to wear a million layers. Maybe mm -hmm. I don't know. Technology and global warming. And global warming. Well, I don't know about that. They're getting lots of snow right now. So uh, this is kind of another vintage look um, with a lion roaring. Joseph does that regularly at two o'clock in the morning. Uh, we can hear him. He wakes us up. The other morning. Uh, yes, and then the larges are the two X's are 32. Yes, they're always two dollars more. And then we've got the um, Tex Tiger version on this as well. These do run a little small. Um, I'm not really All sure of the why. Are just that uh, one. This one's particular. I'm not sure about that one. Actually, I think they both probably run a little small because it's the same company. But I've had a couple people that, you know, whatever size they normally wear, they go up a size. So just keep that in mind. Um, but it's really, it's really a neat. It's just, it's a beautiful, it's just a beautiful um, design. Really, really cool. Came out quite nicely. Um, I'm trying to think what else we got. We do have some uh, polos. polos left. I'm going to be discontinuing them soon because they just don't sell that quickly. It's a great shirt. It's Pima cotton, and it's really soft and it's really nice. But they just, and it's not it's our clientele. It's more expensive. They're 35, but it's also it's a quality shirt. I mean, it's not like. You know, it's, it's not a t-shirt. <laughs> not a t-shirt. It's a polo. So, but I don't think we'll probably be carrying those too much longer. I feel like I missed something somewhere. Show me your bracelet. Oh, good lord! All of your bracelets. I mean, Carol can show you her bracelets if I spin it around. You can see all of them on her. I'm just gonna start calling you Johnny Depp. That's what I decided. So we have multitude of bracelets, and they are all fifteen dollars or so. Um, so some feature. Uh, the tiger eyes, and then what's really cool about this one, you're not going to be able to see it, I'm sure. But it says, I love, I heart BCR. Well, we can see Can it. you Great. see it? Good yes. deal. Okay. So these are 15. Um, I believe they're all online. I know these three for sure are online, but I think all the new ones are too. Uh, so we've got the different um, chakra bracelets. The no, different extra large. colors and everything. Yeah, a lot of these are the extra large. It's funny because some people are complaining that you didn't get any little baby ones for the little skinny people. I'm like, we can never win. We just, you can't. <laughs> you can't, you can't please everybody. So we've got some more jewelry in here. It's all decorated for Christmas. Um, so some are made by volunteers. The, the, um, that glass one is actually kind of nifty. It's $30. It's a little more expensive. This lady makes it. It's called dichrotic glass, and it actually changes color. Actually, let me pull one out. You might be able to see it. You know, I saw that d dichronic glass mentioned online, and I was like, 
I was so impressed with what I saw, but I didn't realize it changed color. Yeah, so it changes. I don't know if you're going to be able to see it on the camera. Well, come on now. So it looks gold, but then yeah, as you, black. so then as you change, as you change position, it will change. So I'm going to let you like move green, around it. Yeah. It kind of goes green and gold red. and red. And then we've got a pink one that kind of changes from pink to purple. Oh, wow. It so it's yellow kinda, and green. Yeah. So it's a little different. Is so, it? That's something. Yeah. And it's like a cat print. Mm-hmm. Who makes these? Um, I can't, uh, her last name is Furman. I can't remember her first name. I like but yeah, that. They're, they're a little different. So I put them on this, um, so it's, it's a little more than a choker. So it kind of will stand out to about like here or so. Um, you can put it on whatever you wanted, obviously. If you want to put it on a longer chain, you could do that. Um, I don't see the pink one. It might be hanging over there. Um, but yeah, so that actually came out quite nicely on the uh, camera. I wasn't sure if it would. Figured it might be a little more like our 3D items. Um, we got some more of the bracelets over here. Lots this is some more jewelry. We've got, and what's kind of cool is it's, okay, poop again. So the paper that this on is recycled elephant poo paper. <laughs> it is, see, printed on 75% elephant dung. Lovely. <laughs> I don't think it smells. <laughs> it just well, smell. they're herbivores, so it wouldn't be bad. Um, so this is, they're roughly, most of them are $8. They kind of vary in price. Um, and that's kind of cool. We've got your Egyptian cat, your lion, your tiger, your leopard in the grass, your whimsical, I'm a cat trying to steal a fish. Uh, if you like peacocks, which we used to have, and I did not like them, um, but that's okay. Um, you can definitely wear those two. I'm trying to see. There was one more. Hmm. There's a heron in here too somewhere, but we don't have him out. So if you're a bird person, we got some bird things. A couple of the new bracelets have a little lion head on them. And then we have some that have a leopard head on them. Yeah. Uh, the, the green one will have the leopard new. head. The green one will have the leopard head. Oh, and by the way, this is Barb's color. She Barb. loves this color. Barb Nicholas. Her car is pretty much this color. Not even kidding. It's so funny. I think it's so, color too. Yeah, oh really? So it's got the little leopard head in there. And, and then like it's got the, different colored beads. The little Do, rhinestones on the face. Yeah, so we've got a green one. You know, it's funny is the lava ones threw me off. I thought they were going to be red. I don't know why, because when lava dries, it's black. But I was like, lava, it's red. Mm -mm, no, black. So, but are those there? They are, um, they are. They're in that bin over there. So we're doing a little Christmas here and getting our little Hanukkah bit in there. Got the blue in there too. Okay, we're gonna see what Hanukkah actually is. Cause I can't remember. So yeah, so we've got the lava, be the one with the lava beads just by themselves. Dropping stuff all over the place. I haven't even seen these myself. Oh, so I love them. with just the lava bead. So it's just black there. And then this one has the, the tiger eye. Oh, hold it up straight has the tiger eye and the lava beads on it. And then we've got the blue jasper with the leopard head on there. What's the other one? I think that's everybody. There are a total of five. So, so it's one, two, three, four, five. I think that's it, yeah. So that's it. Uh, also, if you like mints, these are actually pretty tasty. They're two fifty, and then once you eat all the mints inside of them, you can use this tin for whatever you want. It's great for in your pocket if you're keeping um, like some ibuprofen or something. You just don't want it just hanging out in your pocket. You can do that or change or you know, whatever. Little kids like to keep little funny mementos or whatever in there, so works out nice. Um, they're kind of like um, what are those? Uh, I can't think what they're called. Mentos? No, not Mentos. The really strong one. I can't think what it's called. So we have a lot of our um, our um, we got an empty hat one here. Uh, we've got some hats that we have. We've got you already saw the silver trust one. We've got a uh, visor for twelve dollars, and then we've got a trucker hat that's pink with the gray. We also have a green and white version of that, and they are right over here twenty dollars. That's the one I was thinking was missing, but it's not. The black hat is missing with the gold, and it's 14. Um, we've got a few more things for your car. Bumper stickers. Bumper stickers that are $2 a piece uh, that don't want to stand up. Stay. Uh, these ribbon magnets are $5. You can have it in gold or silver. Just remember to take it off before you get to car wash. Um, 
we've got for the people that live out west where they've got to have a license plate on the front too we've got the license plate frame and those are i want to say 12 yep they're 12 on the back too, you? yeah you can use them on the back but a lot of people because they can't get our license our vanity plate on the front they get these instead oh. so that works we've got carabiners in multiple colors they are three dollars they are not weight bearing so you can't use them for climbing but you can use them for keeping your keys on I like use I do them all the time. <laughs> um, so that works out nicely. You have multiple colors for that, and they do say Big Cat Rescue on them. If we flip it over, mine don't say Big Cat Rescue. <laughs> well, you gotta get the real ones. I then. do. <laughs> I've got um, the fake knockoffs. <laughs> <laughs> I had that for a while too. Um, this is a magnet and sticks to your car quite nicely. This one's a sticker magnet. It is on like the window. Mm -hmm. Uh, magnets three fifty. The sticker is three dollars. Uh, these say I support Big Cat Rescue. They're five dollars. They're a window cling, so you've got to like peel and stick kind of deal. Um, and then we've got these uh, part of the Crazy Cat Lady uh, window shades for your sunshades for your cat um, or for your cats for your car, not for your cat. <laughs> Don't leave your cat in your car either. That's not good. Um, so it works out kind of nice. Actually, Angie has a white car like that, and she got them. And I was like, ah, that's awesome. <laughs> Um, and then uh, we've got the Iron Man shirt over here. For adults? For adults, yes. So I had been asked and asked and asked, well, we've got the kid version, I went to the adult version. So now you can match your children if you want to. Um, <laughs> and there's so many people that are, you know, big fans. So I figured, why not? Let's do that. Um, then we do have a less expensive t-shirt that is just our logo on the front and on the back. So these are 15 um, 17 if they're the double X and then we have a women's version that is um, purple and it has a scoop neck and a flared fit at the bottom it's what it's up in the front um, so we we change I don't know we just didn't um, are we do have some bandits? pictures are they available online? they are not Jamie's are these most of these are mine because Jamie didn't get a chance to make me more before um, the walkabout because she was busy on vacation and then busy with the walkabout. So she does have all of hers are listed online and she prints them as they're ordered. Well, you did some really nice pictures. Those are great. Thank you. Uh, the ones on the right side are, um, these four are all hers. Um, and then she's, she'll eventually get me some more when she has downtime. <laughs> and she has, I think, downloads that you can buy on the- Yes, she does. Store. Yeah, so she's got, so all of hers are listed and then mine are in here. Um, and then, um, I think what else we got. Did we miss any shirts up there? I don't think um, so. We missed that one. Yeah. I don't remember seeing no. this or we this. Do this one. Oh, I forgot these two. Um, so we have the lion wearing a beanie. Um, he's very prominent with his big cat rescue. It's kind of a John Lennon kind of looking deal, kind of a throwback. Um, these are 20 again and then 22 for the large ones. Um, this one's kind of a little more uh, manly, I guess, um, with the big cat rescue down the side. Uh, just going for a slightly different design. See if people like that. And that's getting to be very popular to have the design go mm -hmm. the other way. Yeah. So maybe this will come back in and we were ahead of the curve. <laughs> so I'm hoping. Oh, the women's uh, polo is up here, which also didn't sell as well. It's not on the line. It's a really nice polo. It's a fitted cut, so it's yeah, kind of that might be thin. why. That might be why it didn't sell as well. But these are 32. Um, they're, they're the wicking, they're the dry wick kind of thing. So it's, it's a really nice shirt, but the polos again, just didn't do that well. And then this is the, um, planer, uh, with the, uh, logo and then the logo on the back. And this is a women's cut. It's got a little bit of a scoop neck and a little bit of a flare at the bottom. And then this was, it's got the bigger on the back. So you can also get more of these at our, um, online store in multiple colors. So if you like turquoise or bright green or whatever you can get whatever color you want um kind of deal there the other uh sparkly shirts that carol likes are these guys um we have those Make it sparkle they do sparkle oh it's so pretty they are quite nice and they're 20 and 22 for the larger sizes we got the tiger the snow leopard and the regular leopard and these guys so i think that's pretty much everything we've got i want to say oh can you we didn't get the sponsor kits we didn't do the sponsor kits, so we gotta talk about them. So the other thing that you can do, which makes a great gift, um, lots of people really like doing this. Here's our other little tree, I just, she's so cute. So this is, was from, to love you from Thurston. 
I like that the boys went shopping. That makes me happy. <laughs> so we'll go on this side because I'm missing one over there. So what's really cool about this wall, and you can do this for the person who has everything. You can't think of what you want to get them. Um, you can sponsor one of our cats. So what you do is you pick whatever species you think they like or they have a favorite species. And you do that. And it goes from $25 up all the way to $5,000. Uh, we have through 100 featured on the wall, but we can make more. Um, and so you have to pick the species of cat. And then inside, you can give it away to them. And it, let us know if it is a gift. We'll put tags over the cover over the prices and everything. So inside it has their information that they mail back to us. They pick the individual cat they want. And then they get an 8x10 picture of that cat sent back to them with either passes or whatever the kit calls for. So you can so do that online. So different kits have different swag that comes mm -hmm. along with Yep. It. And each thing is designed online. They all come with a window decal, which is getting in my way. Which is why I can't put this back in here. That looks like this and it's purple. So it's obviously backwards because it's a window cling. But, um, but yeah, they're really kind of cool. Um, people give these as presents like crazy. Um, we've had whole classes support specific cats or specific species. We have a kid's version. Um, we've got the coloring book inside that kid's version, and they get a kid's pass with it as well. Um, and we do all the different species we have here, uh, and it works out quite nice. So we do break out the uh, Canadian lynx and the Siberian lynx. We also um, usually break out the two leopard colors, but currently don't have the blacks out there because we're not sure what's going on yet. <laughs> so when you say you break it out, you mean they can buy a black leopard kit mm -hmm. or a golden leopard kit? Yeah. We don't have the black leopard kit available right now because of jinx, so we're not, yeah. I can't show this picture yet. <laughs> yeah, so we can't do that. So, um, so yeah, so it's very interesting. It's very exciting. It's very cool. It's, an, it's a neat way to, um, I had um, my aunt growing up, she gave me a kind of really interesting gifts. Um, and she adopted a wolf for me once and she adopted a humpback whale. Yeah, it was a, yes, it was a humpback whale. And so its name was Cat's Paw, which was hilarious. Um, and so I got a picture of the fluke of the tail because that's one way they tell the whales apart. It's not like the cats, they're, you know, but their flukes look different. And so it was an actual picture of that. And so I had that on my wall for years and I had a picture of the wolf on my wall for years. So it was really kind of cool. It was probably a similar thing, 25 bucks or whatever. Um, all of her stuff arrived in Neiman Marcus boxes though. So I always knew it was from my Aunt Patty. It was great. <laughs> um, yeah. So funny. And then it I actually such went. A nice gift though for people like you said who have everything and mm -hmm. you want to give them something that's meaningful. You mm -hmm. don't want to just go waste money on. Mm -mm. So you're helping yeah. a charity. You're giving them something cool, you know, or you can do it in memoriam of somebody, or if they just lost an animal or something like that. Um, so very very cool. Um, so we we just had a couple come in uh, who had lost a family member and they did in lieu of flowers they did donations to Big Cat Rescue so they figured they'd get like five hundred bucks or something from the friends and family thirteen hundred dollars so yeah. they were floored they came in they're like we want to donate it all I was like okay let's do this so yeah so I mean you can get creative that way um, you know some people they just they don't need anything once you're an adult you're kind of like unless you're paying my bills. I don't need anything. You know, that's the same kind of thing. So that's that kind of thing. And so you just can't figure out what you want to get. And they have a favorite cat they like. Do that. So it works out really nicely. They'll put the picture up at work or home or whatever. And they'll think of you when they do it. Thank you so much for taking us through all of these items in the <laughs> gift shop. It's an hour and a half. Thank you for giving me an hour and a half of your time on Thanksgiving. Can, as a last thing here, can you tell them what shipping is like? So when they order something, what can they expect? Um, yeah, we try to ship it. <laughs> it's Karma and I. So um, uh, we try to do it within like three-day turnaround. We can't guarantee that sometimes um, items are either being made. If it's Jamie's jewelry, it takes her a little bit longer. It's got to dry, all that kind of stuff. Um, so sometimes it takes us a little bit. Or if an item just went out and I'm waiting for it to come back in or something like that. But generally within a week or so, you get everything. Um, most of the time we can do it the same day. Uh, it just kind of depends. During Christmas. And when you say turn around, you're talking about it's three getting, days here. Right. Or a day here getting it ready. Right. Getting it back out. Right, right, right. Because right. that's not the only thing we're doing. Although it will be during that period of time. That'll be the only thing I'm doing. I'll be in my office just shipping. That's all I do. Um, and then think about inventory and go insane. You just um, had to say the inventory. I did. 
because I want to make Carol cringe. Um, you make the but, camera all jumpy because I'm like, oh, I don't want to hear that word. Yes, <laughs> but I have to because this is, oh, it's killing me. It keeps me up at night. Um, but if my inventory is just a tiny bit off, I sell something I don't actually have and then you gotta wait for it. So, so that's um, why everybody has to buy everything so there's nothing to count. That would be excellent. I would love that so much. And then they can all have a heart attack when I reorder it. <laughs> Gail can have a heart attack this time, though. It would be her, her and Howie. So, but yeah, it would be great if I sold out of stuff. I mean, that Catopoly game, it's, it's amazing that I'm actually willing to play it. Because I'm like, I am so tired of shipping these things. But I've got boxes that they fit in now that's nice and neat. And I have envelopes they fit in now nice and easy. We were having to cut our big bags and wrap them. And we were like, oh, we've got to fix this. This is crazy. Um, the nice thing about the little crazy cat lady ones is they made them smaller. <laughs> Like these fit in more boxes. <laughs> Do that. But they didn't. Um, so, yeah, so between, you know, decorating and taking care of the cats and all the good stuff and it being new and exciting and pretty. Um, so, we're, we're doing really well. We appreciate it. It's from, you know, support from you guys. I know many of you wear many, many, many of these items. So, we're trying to keep getting new stuff and, you know, changing stuff up from time to time so it's not the same all the time. Um, but yeah, happy holidays, happy Thanksgiving. Um, enjoy your friends and family today. That's what we're gonna do after we get done with the cats. And uh, I got to do a little bit of paperwork, so that was good. A little bit of other stuff that I don't usually get a chance to do. So thank you so much. Nicely. Thanks. Bye. Bye.